Hi, Dress Up Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're gonna draw Taylor Swift in her Eras Tour Lover outfit. So let's get started. To draw cute Taylor, let's first start by drawing her eyes. So I'm gonna come right here and start with a circle. And then I'm gonna come across about this wide and draw another circle. There. So with my two circles in, let's make them draw so cute eyes with two small circles inside for highlights. And a curved line at the bottom. And shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. There. So now I have our eyes in, let's spruce them over some lashes. So I'm going to come to the sides right here and I'm just going to come about right here and pop out a curve. And maybe one more, just a smaller one. So same thing here, towards the side, pop out one big curve and thicken it up. And another one. Then from there, let's give her a sweet smile. So about right here, I'm going to go ahead and just draw a curve and cap it off then now let's go ahead and frame her face so i'm going to come really close to these lashes at the top of her eye about right here on both sides and i'm going to draw basically a bottom of a u so i'm going to come here come down and i'm just going to come back to my center approximately how low i want her chin so I'll say about right here, just to make it a little bit easier for me to see where I'm going. And I'm gonna go ahead and draw a curve coming down. And same thing here, make it a little bit more angular and bring it in. This is always the most delicate part. Okay, so then from there, let's go ahead. We need to draw her bangs. So I'll bring this up a tiny bit. And then let's go ahead. And I'll start about maybe here. And let's draw. Let's see. We're going to start by right here over her eye. So I'll start by right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and go up and down with these zigzags to create her bangs. So right over her eye. So sometimes a little bit bigger. Flat, maybe sometimes sharp, but we just want to change it up and come out in whatever space you have left. And so same thing here, a bigger one here, down, and out right there. So just something like that. And then whatever space you have left, and it's kind of weird, but uh, maybe about right here, like where her brow is, you can draw a little indication of her brow. I feel like it needs it, <laughs> where we can see it. There. Okay, so then from there, uh, let's see here. Let's bring this up. So now that we're out a little bit, we're gonna go up to complete her bangs. So same thing here. Let's bring it up nice and high, so, so say about right here. And same thing on the other side. There. Okay, and then we're gonna go up in the center about right here, just a little bit, and then just give a little bit of curve on both sides or the top of her head. We're just drawing this little dip at the top and then let's bring this down. And close to her head. There. 
Okay, so then from there, let's work on her body before we finish her hair. So let's come back to the center, about right here. Give her a little neck here and here, and then we're gonna curve it out to draw her shoulders. So same thing here. Her shoulders. Then I'm just kind of imagining her armpit area. So let's say about right here and here on both sides. And I'm going to draw angle line down, coming in. And then from there, we can go ahead and say about right here, I'm going to draw a curve. And same thing here. And then let's finish it off. So it's kind of like drawing a swimsuit. An opening right here on the top. And then you can pop this part out a little bit. So it's very beaded, right? So then from there, let's bring this down a little bit more. Give her waist. And then about right there, you can start to come out. There. So um, let's go back and I'm gonna, gonna take a look See where I want to start her leg. So let's bring this down. And I'll say about right here. I'm just gonna give myself a point right in, a little line right in the center. Then from there, I'm gonna use this line and I'm going to come about right here. It's easier for my hand. I'm gonna come down with a curve. So same thing here. Go up and across. Then from there, we can start her legs. So let's come in right here and we're gonna draw two angle lines. So let's bring this down. So I'm gonna work on this leg first. So she, I'm just having her stand with her legs wide apart. So let's say about right here, we're gonna start to bring it in. So we're gonna get thinner as we come down. And about right there, I'll stop because I need to, if you're using a pencil, just go ahead and finish it going down and making it thinner, but I'll stop about right there and cut it off for her boots. So once again, we're just going to go out a little bit, but going at the same angle. So we're still continuing our way down for her long legs. So about right there. I'm gonna go ahead and start her shoe, the foot part. So right here, angle it, and simplify it and connect there. Okay, so same exact thing on the other side. Now that we have something to follow, we can go a little bit faster. So once again, about right there, top of the boot, Pop this out to about right there. And once again, this same thing over here. And the foot. Curve and then in. Curve. And connect. There. Okay, finally have her boots in. Then uh, let's come back and draw her arms. So I'm just having them on her hip to make it a little bit simpler. So I'll say about right here. I'm gonna come out. I want her hands about right here. So about right there. And I'm gonna angle it down and angle in. So let's continue this down. And then bring it in. And then about right here, down, and then a finger. There. So same thing on the other side. So I'll just drag this point across. So I'm approximately the same on the other side. About right here. And then once again, bring this down to about right there. And thicken everything up. Elbow and come in. And a finger. 
there okay then from there let's see here your chin a little too sharp <laughs> you know, flatten it out a little bit very subtle but uh, bring that in okay so then from there we can go ahead and finish the rest of her hair so I'm gonna come right here and just taper a curve and same thing here So we don't have to draw too many details and then for the rest of her hair just bring it down you can draw a little strand comes out and then bring it in and same thing here I'm just gonna tuck it in and have it come through and zigzag and in and maybe the other side I'll just leave it so we don't have to draw too many details and then for her necklace, I'm just going to add a heart right in the center. And then just thicken it up with these jewels. I'm just going to draw a bunch of circles that go around. There, so hopefully that helps. And for the coloring part, it's very... Um, how would you say there's lots of sequins and jewels and beads and all that stuff going on so when you're coloring just color with a light base of a pink and then just use your marker with wherever you want your colors and just kind of dab at it to create all those little uh, colors on her outfit but hopefully i've helped you draw her fun and easy today in her lover uh Eris Tour Lover outfit and that you love how it turned out and I helped you draw it fun and easy. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.